Today's video is in partnership with airspotters.com, one of the leading websites for aircraft model collectors. Whether it's aircraft models or aviation toys, stocking everything from Gemini jets, MG models, Skymarks, Aero Classics and more, check them out. The link is in the description below. Hello and welcome to another model review here on my channel. Today's offering is somewhat of a double act as I have two models up for review. First is this Skymarks 1130 Jet 2 Boeing 737-800 for us adults and for the kids. Jet 2 Boeing 737-800 that was authorised by Jet 2 themselves. Both of these models are available at airspotters.com. All links to the models and website are down below in the description. Let's start with a Skymarks model. These models come in what I call kit form, meaning you have to assemble them yourselves. But what I can say is with me owning quite a few Skymarks models, the quality of the models never ceases to amaze me. Today's aircraft in question is Golf, Golf Delta Foxtrot Romeo, a Boeing 737-800 which started her life with Lauda Air in Austria in July 2003. She then joined Austrian Airlines in February 2010 and was withdrawn from use in November 2012 before joining the Jet 2 fleet in March 2013. The box this model comes in is pretty basic, but right off the bat you can see what airline and aircraft you are buying through the clear section on the front of the box. As with all Skymarks models, the logo is placed towards the top of the box, and the phrase aircraft of the world in the bottom right hand section. We can see if we turn the box over that on the top is a series of wording, telling you that there is no glue required and that the plane comes with a stand. On the flap, it indicates that this is an adult collectible. And once more, as standard, a warning about small parts and how this model is unsuitable for children under 3 years of age is included. On the bottom of the box, we have the company Daron Worldwide Trading logo on the left of this box, with a recycling logo to say the packaging is recyclable and further warnings of unsuitability on the right hand side. On the back we have a small diagram of a Boeing 787 Dreamliner and how to assemble this model. It really is that simple. If we take the packaging out, we can see the main fuselage and front nose wheel section are all in one piece. It lays in a plastic mould with a clear plastic piece to hold it in place. Where's everything else I hear you ask? Well, if we lift the moulding with the fuselage in, we can see another compartment with the wings, engines and stand, as well as a small duplicate promoting other aircraft and airlines Skylarks models have to offer. Overall, I'm a big fan of the packaging as it's compact and well utilised. Let's put her together. So to start, you want to take the fuselage out of the mould and remove the plastic covering. Then attach the wings. They can be a little stiff to attach, so be careful when doing this. You can also see that the main landing gear is attached to the wings as well. Remove the engines from the small bag. You can see these are already made up for you, whereas on larger aircraft like the 747, you would have to connect each piece together. Gently attach each engine to the wing. Gently press the stand into the model. And there we have it. Your 737-800 is completed. And I'm super impressed with this model. Really, really am. You get your money's worth with just a size alone. And again, the quality is extraordinary. I would recommend this model to every collector and you can buy it in the description below. Now, if you're looking for a model that you want to buy for your young child but fear it won't be durable and will break easily, then this Jet 2 authorised toy is for you. This is made to be durable and take all bumps and knocks you would expect a model to take from a young child. The box is small, with the Jet 2 logo on the top part of the box, and the Daron logo on the bottom left. If we take the contents out, which is taped down, you can see the plane is held onto a piece of cardboard by plastic wiring, which can be removed by pinching the plastic on the back, so it goes through the hole. Once removed, you have your model, and for a kid's toy, it really is a weighty aircraft. You can feel the durability and just how tough it is, and definitely recommend it to anyone looking to get their young ones into aviation. Again, you can purchase this via the links in the description below. Let's take an in-depth look at the both of them.
Well, that's it from me. What do you make of these models? Would you buy them? Or have you got these already? Let me know in the comments below, and let me know of any models you want me to review in the future. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new around here, it would really help the channel out, and help me get to 1000 subscribers. But for now, continue to look after yourselves, take care, and I'll see you next time. Today's video is in partnership with airspotters.com, one of the leading websites for aircraft model collectors. Whether it's aircraft models or aviation toys, stocking everything from Gemini jets, MG models, Skymarks, Aero Classics and more, check them out. The link is in the description below.